Welcome to a new video, as requested in the previous one today we talk about Ian Nepomnichchi. But before we start, remember to subscribe, leave a like and leave a comment on your favorite player, we could choose it for the next video. Ian Nepomnichchi is a Russian chess grandmaster. He was born on July 11, 1990 in Moscow, Russia. Nepomnichchi has been one of the top chess players in the world for several years, with a peak rating of 2,874 in 2014. He is known for his aggressive and tactical playing style and has won numerous international tournaments throughout his career, including the Tall Memorial, the Grand Swiss Tournament, and the Russian Rapid and Blitz Championships. Nepomnichchi is also a member of the Russian national chess team and has competed in several chess Olympiads. Ian Nepomnichchi is a Russian chess grandmaster, who was born on July 11, 1990 in Moscow, Russia. He started playing chess at a young age and quickly showed promise, becoming a grandmaster in 2008 at the age of 17. Since then, he has established himself as one of the top chess players in the world, with a peak rating of 2,874 in 2014. Nepomnichchi is known for his aggressive and tactical playing style, which often involves taking risks in order to gain an advantage. He has won numerous international tournaments throughout his career, including the Tall Memorial, the Grand Swiss Tournament, and the Russian Rapid and Blitz Championships. He is also a member of the Russian national chess team and has competed in several chess Olympiads, helping Russia to win the gold medal in 2012 and 2014. Off the board, Nepomnichchi is known for his friendly and approachable personality, as well as his dry sense of humor. He is widely respected by other chess players and fans alike, and continues to be one of the strongest players in the world today. Ian Nepomnichchi is considered a strong chess player for several reasons, tactical ability. Nepomnichchi has a sharp tactical mind and is known for his ability to see and execute brilliant combinations on the chessboard. Aggressive style. Nepomnichchi plays with an aggressive and dynamic style, which often involves taking risks in order to gain an advantage. This style can put a lot of pressure on his opponents and create opportunities for him to win the game. Strong openings. Nepomnichchi has a deep understanding of chess openings, and is often able to gain an advantage from the opening itself. Good endgame play. Nepomnichchi is also known for his strong endgame play, which is the phase of the game when there are only a few pieces left on the board. Good endgame play is a hallmark of a top-level chess player. Competitive success. Nepomnichchi has a long history of competitive success, having won numerous international tournaments throughout his career. This success demonstrates his strength as a player and his ability to perform under pressure. These factors, combined with his natural chess talent and experience, make Nepomnichchi one of the strongest chess players in the world today. He has won many international chess tournaments throughout his career, including Tall Memorial. This is an elite chess tournament named after the legendary chess player Mikhail Tall. Nepomnichchi won this tournament in 2013 and 2020. Grand Swiss Tournament. This is a prestigious tournament held annually on the Isle of Man. Nepomnichchi won this tournament in 2019. Russian Rapid and Blitz Championships. Nepomnichchi has won the Russian Rapid and Blitz Championships several times, demonstrating his strength in both Rapid and Blitz chess. European Rapid and Blitz Championships. Nepomnichchi has also won the European Rapid and Blitz Championships several times. World Rapid and Blitz Championships. Nepomnichchi has competed in the World Rapid and Blitz Championships, which are held every two years and feature the best Rapid and Blitz players in the world. Chess Olympiads. Nepomnichchi has competed in several chess Olympiads as a member of the Russian national chess team, helping Russia to win the gold medal in 2012 and 2014. These are just a few of Nepomnichchi's many victories, and his record of success continues to grow as he competes in more tournaments. As with all chess players, he has had losses throughout his career. It is important to note that even the strongest chess players lose games, and that losing is a natural part of the learning process. In the context of chess, a loss simply means that a player was not able to find a winning move or sequence of moves in a given game. This can happen for a variety of reasons, including mistakes, oversights, or simply being outplayed by a stronger opponent. Losses are a valuable learning opportunity for chess players, as they can help players identify areas for improvement and give them the motivation to work harder and get better. Nepomnichchi, like all top chess players, has likely learned from his losses and used these experiences to further his development as a player. As a top-level chess player, Ian Nepomnichchi has faced many strong opponents throughout his career and has lost games to many of them. 
Some of his best known rivals include Magnus Carlsen. Nepomnitschi and Carlsen have faced each other many times over the years and have a close rivalry. Carlsen is considered the best chess player in the world, and their matches are always highly anticipated. Fabiano Caruana. Nepomnitschi and Caruana have also faced each other several times, and Caruana is widely regarded as one of the strongest chess players of his generation. Ding Liren. Nepomnitschi and Ding Liren have faced each other in several international tournaments and have a competitive rivalry. Ding Liren is one of the top rated players in the world and has consistently been a top performer in major tournaments. Wesley So. Nepomnitschi and Wesley So have also faced each other several times, and Wesley So is considered one of the strongest chess players in the world. These are just a few of Nepomnitschi's many rivals, and he has faced many other strong opponents throughout his career. It is important to note that, despite losing games to these players, Nepomnitschi remains one of the strongest chess players in the world and continues to compete at the highest levels of the game. The schedule for chess tournaments and matches is constantly changing, and it can be difficult to predict which events Nepomnitschi will participate in and when. However, as a top-level chess player, Nepomnitschi is likely to participate in many of the major international chess tournaments and events throughout the year. Some of the most prestigious tournaments include the Candidates Tournament, the World Chess Championship, and various Grand Slam events. If you would like to stay up to date on Nepomnitschi's upcoming matches, you can follow his official website or check the websites of the various chess organizations and federations for more information. Thank you for following us. Remember to subscribe and like the video. Write a comment about this video and let us know what you would like to see in the next one. Remember that it is a pleasure for us to share the latest information about the magnificent world of chess. Don't miss a single video in this series, soon we will also cover your favorite player, see you in the next video.